It's all right. It's okay. Chris is traveling today. It's all right. It's okay. Cross country. Oh. All right. On uh, today's adventure, we're taking the Gazelle 10 and the first boat. And we are headed for a beach on the Gulf side where I can set up the tent right on the sand. It's something I've been wanting to do. A little bit cloudy today, a little bit rough, but you know, if I let that stop me, you'd never go. So, just passing the bar beach. Everything's looking good. Just cruising along about 16, 15, 16 miles an hour. Uh, watching for shallow spots. Not many people on the sound today because the weather is really not ideal, but uh, I'm excited about getting the gazelle tent on the beach. And it should be a good time. By golly. Got about another 15 miles to go, I think. We've got a little bit of a trek, but that's all good. Closer to Pensacola. Some shallow spots up here. So working my way around that. I look real shallow. Alright, so So a little while ago, we passed the Bar Beach. Now, Pensacola Beach is passed. And then we have the area towards uh, Fort Pickens out there. And we'll be headed past all of that. Look at these waves. It's crazy. It's warm out here sometimes. Currents. the spot I've been wanting to camp right on the Gulf listen to the waves there's the gazelle the boat is over the boats way over on the other side I carried the gazelle and the stuff over to this side so I could camp right on the water All right, got a line out. I'm not sure if we're gonna do any good with it. I heaved her pretty good out there, and we'll see if uh, there's any, it'd be great to get a little whiting or something like that, it would be great. <laughs> Should probably wait for it to be coals, but uh, yeah. <laughs> oh man, the sun's going down. I'm keeping an eye on my rod. I've got uh, a bait out there. It'd be nice to get a hit on that. Good day. It's been a real good day. Life is good. That's the view you want. Out of the front of your tent. Yeah, it's getting late and uh, I'm watching a little 
Netflix movie I downloaded. Getting ready for bed pretty soon. Gonna brush my teeth in a minute. Can you hear the ocean? It's just like right there. Bit foggy this morning. Wonder why all these birds are gathering down here. Got to do my part. Pick up the garbage. Let's hope that's not charged. What the hell is that? I don't know, but it's full. We're about to get some serious rain coming from this direction, but it sure looks like it's over there. Anyway, before it does, I want to run over and check my uh, my pinfish trap. See if I have any pinfish because if I do. I may do some fishing while it's raining. We'll see. That looks eerie. Best way not to step on stingrays, drag your feet. That way you kick them on the side if there happens to be one. And he won't nail you, he'll just swim away. Nice and shallow spot to keep the boat. I don't know what the heck happened here. Have any little pairs in there? Little tiny, tiny baby fish. Shit. Well, we're gonna leave that there for now. I think. So the rain. Uh, took away the fog, so now you can kind of see the weather. This just kind of goes south of us, but I think this, whatever this is, is coming at us. It's weird the radar shows are coming at us, but I feel the wind coming from the east, like that's coming at us. And that is pretty close. And I'm trying to get my crab traps out, so... Uh, I'm gonna have to move fast. Cause that sure does feel like it's coming this way. So you see the tent over there. I'm trying to beat this this bit of weather that seems to be coming this way. And I am going to the boat to get the crab traps. Because I have the stuff. I want to put those crab traps out. Before this rain hits and then I'll be able to check them after. Got two crab traps right out there then some grassy area. It's not too deep but uh, if I get bait that would be fantastic. Boat's doing fine. Getting a little bit of water with this rain but uh, not too shabby. I like leaving it in walk you know we're knee deep water or maybe a little more <laughs> depending on the tide. Anyway, she's doing fine out here. I'm gonna have to replace the batteries and the light. Looks like it burned out last night, and you gotta have a light on the back of your boat, so I'll take care of that in a little bit. It's about time to eat something. Since we're probably gonna get some rain, I've kinda got the little propane burner going here underneath the tarp. And not that I'm really too concerned about it, but I'm gonna make some uh, ham bacon, egg, breakfast burritos. Gonna be awesome this morning. Sorry y'all are missing out. I'll show them to you once I get them rolling. <laughs> this right here. This is living like a king right here. Got my hot sauce. Ready, breakfast burritos. The ocean, a storm coming. Coast Guard out, fishing line out. Boats here, crab traps are out. Pinfish traps out, just hanging. 
wonder how long that rain's gonna last. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Afternoon of day two. And you think, you know, yeah, it doesn't look too bad. But then you turn and you look the other way. <laughs> Yes, that is a storm front there. Oh, way Toledo. And the little gazelle tent. <laughs> oh dear. Getting even a little more intense. But doing good, by golly. Shaking it up a little bit. But not a drip anywhere that I can see. I mean, I haven't really been seeing any wet spots. The old gazelle's holding up. It's been a rainy day. Some of the gun. All's good. <laughs> Damn. Just giving that, taking a little bit of the pressure off. Got a good twist stake in the ground. But uh, man, it's, everything's on this one side. And I don't want it to pop in, pop out. Shit. Blasting. Calm down now, calm down. Whoa. Whoa, you want to see what it's like outside? <laughs> we got some hot chocolate. Got a little blanket on the toes. <laughs> All is good. A little bit of a rainstorm. Son of a bitch. Serious. I'm going to be bailing that boat out. That's for sure. I went across. Put new batteries in the, in the stern light on the boat. Had to get that done. Man, it is blowing, and it slowed down, and it was blowing. Um, so tomorrow we'll see if it's blowing like this. I'll stay another day. I've got enough food, water. That's not a problem. Um, difficult to fish and stuff when it's just windy and freaking raining like a son of a gun. Anyway, that's all cool. It's all part of it. Got to really test the gazelle tent. It's doing great. It's taking a beating from the wind and it's just holding up really nicely so far. So <coughs> hopefully that continues. Uh. It is morning of uh, the third day. Um, second night, third day. I'm gonna spend one more day, one more night, and leaving in the morning tomorrow. to be this windy. We're talking 10 mile an hour winds. It's blowing like 30 mile an hour winds just non-stop. Absolutely insanity. Always be prepared with all your stuff you may need because I'm staying an extra day because tomorrow's winds should be better because I'm trying to move that boat 15 miles in this. That's just insanity. So I'm going to wait it out one more day. 
I got some electronics charging over at the boat. I'll be checking on that often just to make sure everything's intact. And I'm gonna turn on the little buddy heater in a second and uh, just warm it up in here a little bit. Damn, the weather just is so freaking windy you can't even fish about blows you over. So this must be how they feel on that show alone, you know, where you're just hanging out. It's so freaking windy and nasty out that you're just kind of huddled, staying warm. Of course, they don't have a heater, buddy. <laughs> but uh, just kind of kicking it, and, uh, just hanging out. Everything's good. I'm uh, charging the um, notebook or the tablet, computer, and the power pack at the boat right now and I've got to get back over there and get it before it starts raining. You know, I see the batteries running low on, the, on this on this as well so that uh, battery pack thing I'm charging with the with the uh, battery on the boat hopefully uh, keeps me charged up especially with the phone and it'd be cool to be able to watch a movie tonight so I'm charging the tablet too We'll see how that does. At least a couple hours of charge time before it starts raining. The wind sure hasn't slowed down. Yes. Day three, just uh, hanging in the wind, <clears throat> eating some chicken yeah. and rice, cooked it outside. Yeah, look, sorry, I'm um, too east. I had to prop up a bunch of stuff yeah, around right. it so um, it uh, look, uh, didn't put the flame out in the wind. But anyway, I got to cook and watch a little uh, deep water TV okay. show. Fine. Hanging out. You tell us about it's all it. good. Here we go again, night three. Holy oh, shit. Oh, I am sick of wind and rain, man. It has really just been too much. Found in rain, man. Found in rain. Trying to say goodbye to the beach. For the time being, anyway. Time to break down the tent. Like I wasn't even here. Alright, we got everything loaded. We came from our beach over there. Thank you. 